My name is Lorraine Kurz and I am from Greenfield, Massachusetts. It's not like someone who is feeling a little bit sick. This is non-stop throwing up for days on end and he was having trouble controlling that. Um, as well as keeping any food down, so he was losing weight pretty rapidly. He had tried Marinol, which is something that they suggested, and that was not as effective for him. That didn't work for my son, but the medical marijuana actually did work. My son, at the age of 29 had to face his own mortality. I can't imagine how difficult that was for him on a day-to-day -day basis. His anxiety levels were pretty high initially. Once he started using the medical marijuana, they were a little bit easier for him to control and he actually had a much better quality of life because of it. I think it's a horrific thing to watch your child suffer like that and ultimately to have to help them face the end of their life, um, but I think it would have been just so much more horrific had he not had something to help alleviate some of those symptoms. I would say to voters um, to vote yes on number three because it helps with quality of life for many people who are sick. Um, there are a lot of medications that have much heavier side effects than medical marijuana, which we didn't really see any side bad side effects with and that it could help to improve the quality of life or pain control or other things that help pe people to maintain their independence for as long as possible.